Hi. Hope you're doing well. Hope you had a great Christmas. Feeling fine and nothing but good news about whatever happened on your Christmas. Naturally, there are always going to be some problems, but I hope in general everything went well. Well, Kevin Hart is suing his former employee, Maisha Shakes, and of course, Tasha Kay, whose name is um, Latasha Transrena Kibi, and also suing Kibi Studios and um, I think those are the only two that are named so anyway he's suing because Tasha Kay interviewed one of his former employees she said she had a um, non-disclosure agreement with Kevin Hart but I guess he was paying her every year for the non-disclosure agreement it was a three-year contract and I was under the impression it had expired who knows but uh, anyway he's going for extortion because he says he talked with Tasha Kay and she said she would not play the um, interview if he paid her 200 some thousand dollars he didn't and so she said well she's going to play it and she did and then he's also going for breach of contract that would be the non-disclosure agreement intentional interference with contractual relations that refers to Tasha K and invasion of privacy public disclosure of private facts defamation so that was filed I believe on the 23rd of December just before Christmas I looked on the internet I didn't see it filed yet on the internet so we'll have to wait until that comes out and see how that ends up Oops. Let's see. So, anyway. So, we'll see how it ends up, but Tasha K is in for another lawsuit. I hope she has attorneys she is more compatible with since she didn't seem to like her last attorneys. Um, as far as Tasha Kay's uh, involvement, I don't think she had any contractual agreement not to put this out, but he's saying that she put it out because he refused to pay her 200 some thousand dollars, and that's the extortion part of it, and then she did put it out which would be the public disclosure of private facts. So this will be interesting case. But you know, like most defamation cases, if she's telling the truth and she has no allegiance or contract with Kevin Hart I don't think she is going to be held liable he called her to not have it put down and then she said the amount it wasn't as if Tasha K was chasing him for money at least that's my impression but I'm not going to say anything until we see the lawsuit and I'll just have to look for it on the internet in the next couple days. Anyway, continue having a great holiday. Love and kisses to all of your family. Don't forget to kiss the dog or the cat.
Christmas is such a wonderful holiday. Okay, I'll talk to you later. Bye.